In this video tutorial, we will take a look at all the functions of AI Assist in MaxQDA. With the help of artificial language intelligence, AI Assist automatically creates summaries of selected texts or codes, explains terms, and provides suggestions for new codes or suitable subcodes. With AI Assist, we can summarize the content of complete documents and thus get a quick overview of the key topics in an interview, for example. To do this, we simply right-click on a document in the Documents window and select the option AI Assist – Summarize Document from the Context menu. In this window, we can specify our summary and customize the language, length and type of summary. The language of the existing document and the language of the summary do not have to be the same. AI Assist recognizes the language of the current segment and translates the summary if necessary. These options are similar for all AI Assist functions. If we now click OK here, AI Assist performs the analysis and the result is then displayed in the document summary, which we can find below the document memo. As with all other AI Assist functions shown here, we can always adjust the result later. But it's not just complete documents that we can summarize with the help of AI Assist. Individual selections of text can also be summarized. For example, a person's answer to a question in an interview. To do this, we simply select the segment that we want to summarize, right-click on the selected segment, and then select AI Assist – Summarize Text Selection from the context menu. If we now click OK, the summary will be displayed in an in-document memo on the right-hand side of the document browser. We can also summarize a selected segment as a paraphrase so that we can compare this paraphrase with our other paraphrases later, in the paraphrase matrix, for example. Again, we select the segment, then right-click, and this time select AI Assist Paraphrase Text Selection from the context menu. The paraphrase is then displayed on the right-hand side of the document browser. If we have already coded our project, we can also use AI Assist to summarize individual coded segments. To do this, we right-click on the coding stripe of the code name and select AI Assist – Summarize Segment from the context menu. After clicking OK, the summary is created and saved in a comment on the coded segment. We can also create summaries for coded segments using the table view of coded segments. The retrieved segments window, the segment matrix, or the smart coding tool. In addition to individual coded segments, we can also create summaries for all coded segments of a code. This allows us to summarize the content to which the code has been applied in one central location. To do this, we right-click on a code in the Codes window and select AI Assist – Summarize Coded Segments from the context menu. We can also limit the number of coded segments that are taken into consideration here by only including the coded segments from activated documents in the summary. We can also include the subcodes of a code in the analysis. The summary that we can now create is then saved in the code memo. We can also have coded segments summarized in other places, for example, in the segment matrix and in the smart coding tool. We can use the summary grid to summarize the coded segments of a code in a document. Here, we can use this button to create a summary with the help of AI Assist. This summary then appears in the summary window. With AI Assist, we can also get inspiration for new codes. To do this, we simply select a segment from our material and select AI Assist – Suggest new codes for text selection from the context menu. AI Assist then creates a list of possible codes that can be applied to the selected segment and on the basis of which we can create new codes for our project. We are usually also shown an explanation of the respective suggestions. The code suggestions are grouped into thematic and interpretative codes.
we can tick the codes that we want to create, and the codes are then created in the codes window. The explanation is then saved in the code memo. We can also have additional subcodes suggested for existing codes by right-clicking on an existing code in the codes window and selecting AI Assist, Suggest Subcodes, from the context menu. We can now also use the option to insert a list of examples from each subcode. Again, we can also limit the analyses to activated documents. The subcode suggestions are then displayed in the code memo. Last but not least, we can also use AI Assist to explain individual words from our material. To do this, we simply select the term that we want to have defined, right-click and select AI Assist, Explain Text Selection from the context menu. We then receive an explanation of the term in an in-document memo. And that's it. We wish you all the best for your project.